In this video, I'm going to show you how you can have only commands in a text channel. By this, I mean that you can type a command in a text channel, but if you type something else, it will be deleted automatically. And this doesn't have to be only bot commands. You can literally set up any word you want. So let's get right to it. I'm here in my server. I have a bot commands channel. This is the one where I'm going to set it up on. I have invited the Yak PDB bot, which is the one that we're going to use to set it up. And I've also invited Dank Memer just as a guest in this video. We have bot guests in these videos now. Um, now that's just to try the commands. So let's get right to it. Let's go to yakpdb.xyz, which is the site where we're going to set up everything. If you don't have the bot yet, you can just click here at the server and then you'll be able to add the yakpdb bot to your server. So once we are in this site, let's go to control panel. And normally on the top right corner here, you will be asked to sign in with Discord or log in with Discord. I'm already logged in, so I don't need to do that, but I do need to select my server. I'm going to click here in the black house. That's my server. Once I'm in this page, I'm going to go to tools and utilities and then auto moderator V2. In this page, the first thing that we need to do is actually create the list of words that are going to be the permitted ones. So I'm going to create a list, call it something like what? Um, white listed words, just going to call it that, right? Create. Once we have the white listed words list created, let's just put in our words. I'll be doing just the uh, dank member commands. So for example, PLS bow, PLS work. And if I'm not mistaken, it takes each word. So for example, if you do PLS bow and PLS work, um, when I save it, it's just going to separate all the words and it's going to have the PLS repeated. Let me check. Yes. So we don't have to repeat it every time we type in a phrase and the list separates each word. So if you have repeated words, then you can just like omit that. Right. So work. Um, I don't know these commands meme. I'm just going to do this. Right. So I have these four words in my list. So the list is created. Now let's go ahead and create a rule set. This rule set is going to be well, the name for this doesn't matter. I'm just going to type in wide listed words rule set roulette yeah whatever it doesn't matter really so once you create it just click on it here we go so now here we're going to do two things the first thing that we're going to do in this screen is to select the channel where we want this to happen because we don't want it to happen on every channel in our server so let's click on the plus sign and i'm going to select the option active active in channels and then i'm going to select my channel the bot commands this is the channel where i want this rule to be applied on right so we're going to click save and now we have it selected on bot commands. Now let's go ahead and create the rule. Allow only commands. So once we have the rule created, now here's where we're gonna select what happens. The first option is triggers. Triggers is what activates this rule set, right? And the trigger of that will be the whitelist words. So word whitelist and it automatically select the list that we created earlier. And if you had many, then just choose the one that you wanted to take effect on, whatever, um, you know what I'm saying. And the condition is going to be, well, it depends on what you want to do. If you want to create a channel that only people can interact with bots or whatever, or something like that, then you will like it for it to ignore the bots. So you can do that condition, right? Or you can just leave it blank if you don't care about it. Just play around with it. Also, you can make another condition to ignore a certain role. For example, like the mods. Just going to click the damn memer, for example. But you can select, for example, your mods to be able to speak. Or for this to not take effect on a certain role. Whatever, right? You can just play around. Now, the next one is going to be the effect, which is going to be delete the message if the word is not in that whitelist list. So delete message. And basically, this is the overview word white list. The words containing this list are the ones that are going to be only accepted. You will ignore the messages from the bots. And whenever someone says a word that is outside this list, then delete this message. Right. So let's go ahead and save the changes and let's go back to our server and test it out. We have the bot commands channel. I just want to test that it doesn't work anywhere else. So hello, right? It went through on general. Now let's try that in bot commands. Hello. Boom. The message was deleted. As you can see, if I do PLS bal, all right, so that's my balance. But if I do hello again, boom, it is deleted. So only the words that were containing that list actually go through. So this work. Please, baby. 
babe whatever i meant that one wasn't in the word list anyways i hope you found this video helpful and if you did please leave a like and subscribe to the channel it's totally free have a wonderful rest of the day my friends and stay safe out there